Chapter 7 Third Eye Jakes Who is Third Eye Jakes? So I guess this is going to be um, Luke and Leighton while uh, Emmy's in London. Fair enough. Will Emmy be alright on her own? Of course. I shouldn't think we need to worry about Emmy, Luke. She just sped out of here so fast. I hope she doesn't crash. <laughs> Come now, Luke. Let's get on with the investigation. Alright, Mr. Leighton. Where do we go from here? We still need more information on Mr. Bard. Ariana said the people in town weren't very fond of her father. That is what she said. Do you think she's right, Luke? Honestly, Mr. Leighton, I have no idea what grown-ups actually think. <laughs> Fair enough. But we'll have to investigate this if we want to gain Ariana's trust. I suppose so. Let's talk to some people in town. Oh, hello. I see. There's some uh, puzzles sent there. Okay, we'll do them if we need to. So are there still hint coins here, or... Is it all just new... Yeah, so it's been new. We'll, we'll leave them. As you know, I'll talk to you, because you might have information. You've still not back, I'm afraid. Alright, nope, you have nothing. Fair enough, so new people. Got it. Gotcha. Hello. Miss Valerie Police Station's mission is to serve the people. We sincerely refuse not to cooperate. Uh, we open to the general public, but the Chief Constable's got a lot on his plate at the moment. Uh, understood, good sir. I hope you have a lovely day. Okay, you. Oh, that street lamp must have been damaged by the spectre. Yes, I think so. The spectre has attacked several times since Mr. Bard's death. Most of the houses have been rebuilt, but they still haven't fixed the street lamps. Luke, do you remember all of the areas the spectre has attacked? Sorry, I yawned. <laughs> but... Oh, sorry. But I have kept a record of every spot that the spectre attacked. I was hoping this might come in handy someday. Yeah, it did. This is going to be leading to a new area. I don't know what to say. What? Is it no good? On the contrary, Luke. Your organisational skills are very impressive. <laughs> I'm stunned. This is wonderful data. It's just the groundwork we need in order to make some de sound deductions. The more information we gather and cross-reference, the greater chance of us finding the truth. So it's helpful? Extremely. Great work, Luke. Let's continue our investigation. Oh, that's great. Okay. Oh, I can't remember the voice I gave him. Why, you want to ask me some questions? Get out of my face. You can't just go around asking people questions. I can't have my dad arrest you for that, you know. I can have my dad arrest you for that. I've heard your, that your father is highly regarded in town. Yeah, obviously. My dad was one to solve the bad case. Ha! <laughs> Everyone was scratching their stupid heads to my dad showed up. So your father handled that case? Ha! Huh. Can't he handled it? He found the will, the will and the eyewitness. If you ask me, this town's pretty lucky to have him watching over it. Remarkable. You bet it is. Luke, do you know anything about a will or an eyewitness to Bard's death? No, I'm sorry. I was so worried about Ariana, I didn't pay much attention to the investigation. I see. I hope Emmy can dig up something for us. Alright then. Let's see. You have something. With the town in such danger, I did kind of wonder if I should leave, but with Chief Jakes, I feel safe. If you offer to pay me for my for me for my stay and make up for the spectre trouble over in my vacation, it's supposed to be typical in small towns. The unfortunate truly really, like care for the townspeople. I thought, well, it wasn't easy getting into town fast. I came because of the stories in the paper about the Golden Garden, but they turned me away. How did you get in then? The road into town was guarded by the police, but my friend and I just took the back way over the mountains. The spectre appeared on my first night here. The cars were pretty quick. They had the area blocked off, so I couldn't see anything. And you've remained here ever since? I haven't come all this way. It seemed a shame to leave. Plus, the police have all been so kind. My friend got totally terrified when she heard about the whole spectre thing, though. She ran off at the first opportunity. She's in one of these pictures, actually. Can you work out which one my friend is? 
Okay, interesting. One of these girls is my best friend. My best friend has blonde hair, doesn't wear glasses, and a mole under her right eye. Well, I mean, surely it's E. Blonde hair, doesn't wear glasses. I mean, it's gonna be C, isn't it? It's gonna be C. A challenging puzzle, to be sure. No, I'm right. Okay, I was gonna say. I love the How is that worth thirty? Solution. You just find someone who has blonde hair. There's three of them. No glasses, there's two of them. Mole, there's... It's easy. I... I just... I... Whatever. <laughs> I don't understand the Picara system. Well, did you see the Golden Garden in the end? Nah, it's too bad. I've been to the uh, excavation site, but there's, like, nothing there. Even the victim is gone now. I'm just hanging around up here, soaking up the atmosphere. Plus, the spectre's still out there somewhere. I think it's good that my body's all paid by the police. I love it here. I wonder if it's normal for the police to pay for people's holidays. The townspeople are probably not aware of how their tax money is being spent. Oh, interesting. The police chief here is supposed to be some kind of super cop. They call them third eye jokes. They say he can solve any case. I just hope his style is as smooth as his name. Indeed. The chief of police with no open cases must be quite skilled. Yeah, mm -hmm. Some people use their skills to solve cases. Some people use their skills to do their hair. The cops do seem to be pretty good about telling which pe people which area to evacuate. Luke, didn't you say that Dolan communicates with your predictions instead of townspeople? tells the police and then they do the ev evacuation. I see. Hmm. Along with the spectrum of the witch and all the golden garden. It just sounds too much, just too much. This reminds me. So we see the excavation site. Okay, let's do it. Just west, eh? Okay, to the west. Gotcha. We got the rat. Just a mouse. Okay. Oh, I recognize this, yeah. Doesn't look like the spectre is responsible for this. No, it's land substance. Since the spectre appeared, sinkholes have been appearing around town. Sinkholes and the spectre. What's the relationship there? Probably another one of the Spectre's pals. I can't remember the I can't remember the voice I gave you. I think it was Andrew actually. I dress up the, as the Black Raven to fool people looking for the black market, but I really hate running. When Ren and the boys tell me I'm too heavy, maybe they're right and I should lose a few, but how? Why not try sharing your treats with, with the other black ravens? Sharing? I suppose that's an idea, but it won't be easy. Could you help me? Cutting the cake. I suppose I could share this triangular cake. It's really tasty, but I can spare half of it. And my friends can divide that between them. Ugh, but it is my cake. It's only fair that I should have most of it. I'll just cut two pieces with a ratio of 4-5. Then I'll take the bigger piece. That's still pretty generous, isn't it? Okay, so... Um, 
Why can I not work this one out? This seems really simple, surely. I could just guess it. I'm trying to work it out logistically, and for some reason, my brain can't do this. Um... I can't work out if it's 9. No, 9 and 6 is too small. It's got to be 8. It's got to be 8. It's got to be. Some puzzles must be met directly. It is not. Okay, is it 9 then? A little more thought is in order. Well, whatever. Time to apply some creative thinking. Is it what? How? How is it ten? It appears as though I've missed something. It's not ten. Is it? A challenging puzzle, to be sure. All right, fair enough. I don't know. I don't know why, but no I can't seem undone. to do that puzzle. That, that doesn't seem to really connect to me. I don't know why. Like, other math I can do, that I can't seem to fathom. Oh well, I solved it, that's all that matters. Uh, right, so. Onwards. Hello. Hi, I'm Nate. I'm part of the Dick team looking for the Golden Garden around here. Dick team, you say? Where is the rest of your staff then? Most of the team gave up after a while. They came to the conclusion that the garden isn't here at all. And is that what you, you also think, Nate? I'd tell you to take a look for yourself, but perhaps blocked by rubble. Actually, we located a precious stone that we want to extract, but it's proving tricky to get it out. If you can help me out with that, I'd happily give you a hand uh, with cleaning that rebel. Okay, rebel trouble. Let's see. Ooh. The dig team located a precious stone buried here, but when they were unable to extract it because the rubble went away, moved the rubble out of the way so you can get the stone. That is a big stone. Okay, so I see how this is going. Um, I see where this is going. I want to do something like this. I want to try and move it so it all... Hmm, yes, I can see where this is going to be a problem. Oh, I can go up there as well. That actually does make things a lot easier. that back. Uh, the idea is sound, I just need to get something like that. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I was going to say, I just need to get something like that in the way of it, so... Yeah, now I can move that. There we go, nailed it. Time to apply some that wasn't creative too bad. thinking. That was alright. I love the thrill of a good solution. That was much easier than the cheese one with the rat. Success, knowing how to use the tight space is the key. It's possible to do it in 14 moves, is it now? So you think the Golden Garden isn't anywhere near here? You'll see once you go to the dig site. We dug deep, but we didn't find anything remotely interesting. No building foundations, no trace of inhabitants, nothing to indicate any every, every hint of an ancient city. There are no other stories about the Golden Garden, but uh, that suggests it could be older, much older than civilization. But there isn't any evidence linking it to prehistoric times either. There's only the legend to go on. I suppose it could be all buried much deeper than we thought. This area is very wet, though. Once you reach a certain depth, you would uh, encounter water. Could the garden be even further below? We can't rule out that possibility. Do you think we, could, we didn't go down far enough? I really couldn't say. 
but I'm very interested in your research. In, in your search. Are you an archaeologist by training? Not really, I've just been working at dig sites my whole life. And my intuition uh, says not to give up just yet. Still, maybe it will come to nothing. Nah, I don't say that. Not yet. Live in hope. Anything to dig up or do you appear to be? Onward! Dynamite. As Nate said, the excavation so far appears to have been fruitless. What makes you say that? I can tell from the exposed strata here. Your father knows more about geology than I do. My father? Really? Yes. In his university studies, Clark excelled at identifying organisms in strata like this. I take it he hasn't ever told you about that. Dad's been so busy with the town, but we haven't spoken much recently. He seems like a different person since he became the mayor. I think maybe Mum left because he, because she couldn't deal with him anymore. I bet she's not. E I bet he's not even my dad. What if the Spectre kidnapped my real dad? Settle down. I too thought that Clark was acting strangely. Is the Spectre controlling him? When did you notice this change in your father? When he became mayor, right before the Spectre appeared. I'm sure Clark will return to his old self once we sort out this case. But I need your help to do it. We'll get to the bottom of this. You believe in me, do you, don't you, Luke? I, I believe in you, Mr. Layton. Thank you, Luke. Once we hear from Emmy, we will speak to your father. Now perhaps we should make our way to the library. You think Emmy is back by now? If she is not, then we can look at some of the archive papers. Maybe we can find something. I see. You know where the library is, don't you? It's east of the crossroads. Ah, that's right. Let's go. Before we do that, I'll just uh, check some of these caverns. Here's a puzzle. Sorting artifacts. Okay. Ooh. An archaeologist shows you some ancient runes found on a dig. These runes were divided into two groups, but I seem to have mixed them up. Can you sort Can you sort the runes into the correct groups? Only the top left rune cannot be moved. Set them up. Okay, so let's look at this. The top left. So what connects that to others? I don't know. My gut instinct says those. My reason being, they have lines that go through circles. The others don't. I'm probably entirely wrong. But I'm going to submit anyway. How about this? No, I thought he was right for a second. I'm just not cut out for this. I don't understand. View hints, go on. Oh, I thought I found something that was in common. Quite a difficult one. Me in common. Oh. Oh, what if it's that? Eyes. Top one has an eye. I think. They're like faces. That looks like a face. Fine, let's try that. Why not? This is what I've come up with. No. I can't Brr. work it out at all. No, neither can I. Show on. Show me. Oh, really? Well then, that's the first problem, isn't it? Show me again. I don't understand. 
I like facing the symbols in each room. It's not helping me. It's not helping me at all. I don't understand. Super hint. Sure. I'd never use them anyway. Oh. This is what I've come up with. Ah, there we go. I knew I could do it. Oh, yeah, you can. Yeah, all right. Nah, fair enough. Fair enough. Oh, you see, I was looking... I could see it with the others. I couldn't see it with that one. But yeah, now I see it. Okay. I gotcha. I gotcha. Hmm. Interesting. Explode things. Explosion! It surely can't be using dynamite to ex ex excavate the golden garden. It doesn't seem like a very safe way to do a dig. No, not at all. I rather hope the golden garden isn't here. I found a pebble. I can say, is it actually going to do anything? Explosions! <laughs> Fun! Okay, so this is the library. Nate, you bastard. Stop blowing things up. 